Welcome, everyone, to another edition of the Sunday Sessions Project. Like last week, I am your host, Matt Walters, and here is Roy and the Secret People. Secret People, Roy, take it away. Yes, Matt, thank you very much. We're going to play a song for you guys right now. It's our first single we released last July. This is called Golden. Secret People. Right now we're going to do an older tune for us, a newer tune for you. This one is, has to do with, you know, when you're with somebody and they're kind of never on time. This song is called Late. That's my girl, yeah, over there. How many times 
desire, that's what she said. When I'm there, oh God, and now you're late. Adrenaline is pumping. Adrenaline is a good thing. So, uh, welcome back here on the Sunday Sessions Project. We're rowing the secret people. And yes, we are doing this on a Sunday. And yes, most of us are probably uh, not in our right head from stuff from last night. I won't mention any names. And um, this next song is off of our first record. This song was written in Biloxi, Mississippi long time ago. So this is a song called Mississippi Sun. Very positive tune. Here it goes.
Nobody caught me on that. Oh, all right. Okay. Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because it's all going to be chopped up anyways. All right, we're now going to, we've we fucked up. We're going to do the second song now as our, they, they don't know that. That's why. Brendan, blaming it on you. Okay, here we go. All right, hold on. Let me talk a little bit for about the song for a second. I know, Ed. Oh, sorry. No. Life is happening. I'll mention it right now. All right. So welcome back to the Sunday Sessions Project. We are Roy and the Secret People. We're going to do our latest single that came out at the end of last year, the beginning of this year. Uh, this is a song that was written around the holidays for a lot of our friends, maybe some of your friends who kind of were at the uh, edge of that cliff and not feeling so well in their personal lives and maybe debated to do something about it. Um, we've all been touched by it at some point and you are not alone and life is precious. So just look around you and see the people who really do care about you. This is a song called Life is Happening and it's happening now. <laughs>
Hey everyone, thank you for watching this edition of the Sunday Sessions Project. If you're just joining us, if this is your first time, this is a little bit of the interview section where we just take some time and we interview the band. And I am here with Mike of Roy and the Secret People. And just before this, Mike and I were talking and you shared a really cool story that I just want to lead off and I want to go right into it. So it was just this December, right? This past December? This past... Yes, this past December in, well, the one that just happened. Yeah, what month are we in? Yeah, uh, we in. Who knows? Yeah. December 2022. Yeah, you guys got a really cool gig. We did. We ended up opening for uh, Corey Feldman on his tour, which was very interesting if you know anything about this guy. He's a very eccentric, eclectic artist, uh, filmmaker, movie star, all that stuff. Um, he's had a weird past with some weird people. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we got the opportunity to open for him. And it was a tremendous experience. Everybody at Vertigo Entertainment who uh, helped us get that gig, uh, we want to thank, give a shout out to. Uh, but nothing but positiveness has happened from that show with us. Yeah, like we were talking about, like, n number one. I guess you're getting a lot of traction. Like, a lot of people saw that. A lot of people were exposed yes, to that. Yes, yes, And yes. then, you know, that leads into social media that Madeline is over there. And uh, it turns out she handles the social media for the band. Yeah. Uh, and so, like, you're seeing all these upticks in, like, your streaming numbers and all things like that. A lot of upticks. And that's so important that shows, which to, is great. to a band, a local band, like, that yeah. wants to get their foot in. Yeah. They want to get out. And yeah. that's the goal yeah. here. So, um, like, what would you say was your overall experience with – after that, like the aftershock of that. I would say that was our good nightcap on the year of 2022. So we kind of all took a break uh, and started gearing up because we had a single that was going to be kicking out uh, right after that show, along with a brand new music video, where uh, which was coming out the beginning of 2023, which has already come out. Um, and we just saw a huge uptick in uh, those viewerships and subscribers and stuff like that on, on some of our, our pages, which has been great. No, and uh, How did you get the gig? That was a, an interesting... Well, we ended up getting the gig... Um, this, this is cool because you get to share this because some people, they often do what you said where they just go, ah, we'll never get it. Yeah, yeah. They, so this is a good story. We kind of like saw on social media, or it was a post somewhere that said, "Hey, there's a big, you know, a national act coming through. We're looking for an opener. Send your EPK, electronics pr uh, press kit, to this address." So I figured, out hey, why not? So I threw our hat in the ring, and I don't know. A month went by. There was just crickets. Um, the show hadn't been talked about or anything. So I think after that, I kind of had forgotten about it. And the rest of the band was like, eh, you know, we're just going to keep moving forward and, you know, kind of put that out of our minds. That was, you know, whatever. Throwing stuff against the wall, which you yeah. have to do all the time. And about, I don't know, it was like three weeks before the show, uh, we were informed that we were picked as the one opener for this leg of, uh, you know, his show on the East Coast at, uh, New in New Jersey. So we were like, get out of here. And so... We didn't hear inf any information on that show until the day of the gig. So we knew, we didn't know what time we were playing. We didn't know our set list. We didn't know literally pretty anything. much anything. Yeah. yeah. So, so you're going into a blind. I said, what time do you want us to get there? And they were like, just show up. And I was like, what do you mean just show up? And they're like, oh, how long are we playing? And they're like, that's usually what they well, tell the lead singer, right? Know. Just show up. Yeah. For, well, <laughs> <laughs> lead singer jokes. <laughs> yeah. And uh, so. We showed up and we waited for their sound check to get done. Went in, had a brief chat with Corey. He's a very cool guy. And then uh, we ended up playing our set to an overly sold out crowd uh, at this venue, which was amazing for us as it was our last show of the year. And it was just, uh, everybody was so nice. and We bonded with a lot of people that night. Um, and it just shows us that, yeah, man, just keep, and, and to anybody out there, just throw your stuff against the wall. You never Seriously. know what's going to happen. Yeah. You just don't. Yeah. So. Well, that's great. And then uh, I want to get into the, the, the two singles that you guys yeah. have just released. Mm -hmm. uh, and you have more music coming. We do. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, what is the first single? Uh, the fir Well, I'll let well, I'll, you want to take that. Well, let's go down the list, actually. Right. Let's you find out. Do that. Let's find out who the band talking. is here. That's all I do is run my jaws. <laughs> I'll take that hey, from it's you. A golden mic. I'll give it to my buddy AJ oh, over here. Don't want to do that. So uh, I want to go down the list, the, the line here, and this is Madeline. And Madeline, you are, uh, 
I would say part lead vocals, mm -hmm. not so much backups, um, yeah, and keys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, keys so. And uh, violin, actually. So it's funny, some of the songs that we ended up playing today, <laughs> because we swapped out a few uh, last moment like we do. Um, yeah. I actually didn't bring the violin because I didn't think I would need it. Uh, so, but you know, we improv on keys when we need to. Do you do this often? Do you guys switch things up on the fly often, like when you're about to play a live gig where you sometimes don't know? Um, yeah, I mean, yeah. Or is everything I, planned out? Oh, no, no. So the show back at... <laughs> yeah, okay. okay. No, there's never a plan. Okay, well, that's good. A bit more of a sp spontaneous group sometimes. Well, so that right. breeds yeah, set, creativity, like, magic. Day, yeah. Saw, the set list is a guideline. So, you know. Right. And right. You, know, you got to gauge like the the crowd and what everybody's feeling and yeah. blah blah. So sometimes changes need to be made. Right. But well, yeah. it sounded fantastic, and I can't wait for the last song you guys are going to play. And then I want to go down the list, and this is my buddy Ed. That's me. Ed, <laughs> you are the lead guitarist. I am. Um. So man, uh, how did you get involved? With, I know you've been with him for how many years or so? And yeah, many now, which is really surprising. Yeah. Fly so fast and we play so many shows and um, you know most of the stuff's been pretty consistent as far as personnel and people and people in the band and stuff like that but you know recently we've uh, just expanded and grown and gone in some new directions and things yeah. like that especially with the new material so um, constantly evolving I'll say. Are you doing a lot of the the guitar parts and writing first and then yeah, giving them to Mike? Of things, you know, okay. Sometimes we just uh, have pieces of a puzzle and end up putting it together. Right. I'm sure some of the new stuff you know we're dynamics because of violin and keys and yeah like that. so hopefully that has a really nice texture to the whole thing yeah, so, but, yeah. very good man of course these guys here yeah uh, AJ, uh, you guys you guys you guys are the unit man yeah you guys are the tight unit Do you, I, I see some good rapport here you guys are both jokesters i can see maybe a little bit just a little bit so i i really like your bass lines i just i like your energy um you're fun you're fun thank you Thanks. Sometimes people aren't fun. No, I know that. I know. Yeah. But, uh, we bring a little bit of energy. Right? That's good. You need the funk, man. That's yeah, you do. This kid here, he's the man. Yeah. <laughs> he brings it out. Yeah. Uh, I'm actually new to the group. Uh, within like, you know, what, like two months maybe? Right? Okay. Or something. Um, so I'm just bringing in a fre uh, breath of fresh air. That's good. Yeah. That can change things up into a positive. Yeah. 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 We play it. We actually been rehearsing at his spot actually, and uh, he has like the what you got the racks and everything. So it's like a whole different type of style, and he's like a real. What'd you say? More metal funk. I'm type more of a player. metal guy. Yeah. And, like it's a good deal because yeah. it's a little funk in there. Right. Like, so it's a good mixture. So sure. do, re rehearsal spaces at your place? Yeah, yeah. I've, I play in a couple other bands. I have a room. We have a whole new practice space it's recently. Awesome. So, awesome. Uh, you know where I keep my drum set. Okay. And uh, the rest of my gear I can't keep at home. Yeah. Know, the loud stuff. Wow, yeah, yeah, yeah. I fully understand. And this kid rocks my drums better than I do. I can't believe it. <laughs> do you guys do any recording in there? Uh, no. Sometimes. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes. Maybe just yeah. scrap yeah, ideas. Yeah, yeah. yeah, right. Yeah, that's it. It has been done before. Okay. Now with this group, we'll get there. Okay. Yeah. All right. Sure. Yeah. We did a photo shoot in there the other day. Did yeah. you? Yeah, we got to update the photos. You, know? you have to, right? Yeah. Did you hire a photographer? Uh, we have a guy. Uh, his name's Everybody's Alex. got a guy. Everybody's and there's Alex. always a guy. Shout out to, shout out to Alex. Alex. He's the guy that shot our music video, by the way. You want to drop uh, his hashtag? Do, 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 do. Yeah. Alex. I think we just did that. So, it's, they do it in post. Yeah. So, anyway. Everything's Alex. done in post. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. So, uh, He'll catch up. You just keep coaching him. <laughs> Bring him up to speed. <laughs> So we're talking about this photographer. Uh, Alex. Yeah. Alex is our new buddy, and he's been doing a lot of work for us, and hopefully he'll be doing more. Soon yeah. enough, we'll be shooting our second video. Uh, we have concepts going. We're working on that stuff. Um, that'll happen soon. We're going to need some help doing that, so if you check out our social media, ask about how you can become part of our next music video. There you go. You secret, secret person. People. Yes. That and we need we a lot more. more secret people to show up for a music video. So have some fun with us. That's we're a great guys. idea. And it's just kind of like, you know, your venture into playing opening for Feldman mm -hmm. on a chance. All these people yeah. can come how in cool and you can be part yeah. of a video on a chance and meet somebody. Yo, how cool would it be if we got Corey Feldman in the video? 
What if we redid? We we completely oh, ripped AJ. off Lost Boys. <laughs> oh yeah. Dibs on all the vampires. Wow, well, all right. Oh, you want to be all, all the vampires? vampires? All the vampire. You're all the vampires. Yep. All, right, that's cool. all of them. Something. Yep. <laughs> it's just begun. So Mike, you like to talk? What I do? You- do? Yeah, what do you want to finish up with? Oh, um, I would say <laughs> if you do like what you're hearing, please check us out online. We're on everywhere digital media will have us. So, you know, just like everybody else, you can find us anywhere. Just Google Roy and the Secret People, R-O-I. Uh, if you can, if you're around, come out to a show. You'll be entertained for sure. And uh, again, You guys are very entertaining. We Thank you so much. You, I watch on the monitors out there. Such a good looking there. man, isn't he? And... <clears throat> Look at those eyes. Uh, and you guys are very entertaining, all of yes. you. So, Thank you. Um, they are fun to watch. Obviously, you're watching right now. Now, you're going to bring us home with one more? Yes, one more. We're going to do one more. This will be, uh, and I'll, I'll repeat myself, but this is a title track off of our first album called Dog Street, song of the same name. Uh, and this was a song when, uh, about real quick, when I was living in New York City and kind of like looking for places to uh, crash and to eat and was busking in the subways. So uh, this song kind of came about around that subject matter. But Cool. Anyway. All right. Well, everyone, thank you again for joining us on the Sunday Sessions Project. Roy and the Secret People are going to play one more, Dog Street. I hope you enjoy it and hope you tune in next time. I've been your host, Matt Walters. Thank you. Bye-bye. Parade the Queen Wave. Bye-bye. All righty, 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 righty. Welcome back to the Sunday Sessions Project. We're Roy and the Secret People. We want to give a huge thout, uh, <laughs> thout, shout out to everybody here on this program. They work so hard, so nice, so professional. I'd give them a call if you need anything done with any kind of videotaping or any kind of multimedia project. These guys are the real deal. Um, last song we're going to play is the very first song recorded for our very first Roy and the Secret People album. This song is called Dog Street. Thank you so much for watching. We really hope that y'all have enjoyed it so far. And uh, here we go. It's a true story. Nobody went to jail for this. Nobody was held overnight in any kind of a lockup with the uh, mental institution. This is all really went down in New York City. Roll me on bone, you baby, pull me a shot. Let the nightmares come, you don't let them run hot. I see you tonight after the show. I saw you leave me once and now you're leaving me twice. I got your feathers wrapped.
face. Oh. More arched back. There you go. Chest down. That's easy. She's wet. Did you get a little splash? My dog's gonna love it. Uh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>